I love just being able to easily expand out of here. This is great. Okay. Look at this, like, gigantic dagger thing that we have going here. We have to, like, hook this up as well. Okay, how, how close can we get to here? Two. That's all right. Not quite three, so we'll leave it at two, I think. enough room for Mr. Idea's big idea. Okay, that's left a little bit of room for Mr. Idea's big idea. Okay. Alright. I think I'm almost ready to unveil my big idea. A big, a big idea that hopefully, I'm hoping, will attract a new type of citizen to San Francisco. Okay? We're looking for a new type of citizen in San Francisco. One who isn't afraid of the future. Yeah? Get on with it then? Oh, come on, I'm trying to build up hype. I'm like Steve Jobs. I'm trying to do a Steve Jobs on you guys. Imagine this. <laughs> Imagine if you can for a second. A world where I don't have any money. Instead, I'm broke as fuck. Nope. I left a road unconnected near old patty cake. No, I did it on purpose. Oh, you mean this one. Oh yeah, thanks. Thanks, Jacob. Imagine a world where the metro isn't the only option. Ah, uh, you guys see where I'm going now? You guys see where I'm going, maybe? It's a little, it's a little, a little hint as to the direction that we're going in. Imagine a San Francisco where you don't have to just take the metro for hours and hours on end. Ah? Uh? Ah? Uh? Think different. <laughs> yes, that's a good one. Think different. Think trains, but not trains. Think rails, but not rails. Think monorail. Monorail! 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 That's right, baby! Oh, shit! That's right! That's right, San Francisco's gonna get its own monorail! Again! For the second time! This time it's gonna work! This time it's gonna be great! It's gonna be incredible! Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, God, this monorail, I'm telling you. <sighs> it's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be amazing, okay? It's gonna get you all around Slough, all right? And it'll co connect into some of the other neighborhoods too, right? Now check it out. You're probably wondering, Mayor, when can we expect to see this monorail? What if I told you I'm going to start building it right now? Right now. That's right. <laughs> okay, 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 everybody. Calm down, calm down. The new monorail is going to be built right now before your very eyes. That's right. <laughs> no, no. Right, that's right. Right now. We're doing it. Monorail station with road. No. Monorail station. Alright, baby. Y'all ready for this? Oh. Oh, hang on a second, actually. We can work around it, okay? We can work around it. Alright, ladies and gents, boys and girls, that's the first station down. From here on in, we're fully committed. 
We're fully committed to connecting up all of our loopy dingle donger dingleheimers. That's right. With oh monorails. They're gonna go all around the goddamn city, baby. They're gonna go the whole hog. They're gonna take you to places you never thought possible. And allow you to get onto the metro in ways you never thought possible either. Look. All the way around. Up and down and inside out. Oh god, this is gonna be great. The only thing is though is that I want it to go all the way around. But I haven't finished building all the way around. You know what I mean? So we're gonna have like some areas where it's gonna go cut like right through the city and then we can maybe hook it up around as well. The distance between stations is too small. Ah, oh, come on, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. You trust me, okay? You just trust me. Trust me on this one, please. I'm begging you. Just trust in, in your old, in your old Pap Pap here. He knows what he's doing, kinda. Sort of, sort of, kind of. So then, mono means one, and rail means rail, yeah. and that concludes our intensive three-week course. <laughs> yes, absolutely, absolument, absolument. Okay, so the monorails go around like this, okay, and then we have another station that's going to be poised here, strategically poised, and then let's have one here. Okay, and then, for shits and giggles, let's plan out the rest of Slough here. So we can go up three. Oh, it's gonna be tight in there. It's gonna be a bit tight. Okay. So we're gonna want a station, like here, ish. Okay, and then we have a gigantic loop, Looper McPooper over here. And then we're going to have a big old station here too. Okay, we have to expand this out now. Is that straight? It fucking better be. Okay, you know what? I think it's straight. Okay, good. Wait. We can kind of go to here. And then this one here can go up to about here, which actually that's perfect. Okay, good. And then we have some space in the middle there. Okay, so we have to run this through here like so. sort of meet in the middle-ish there. Same with this one. It's got to go to about here. A little nubbin. Okay. And then we can just build the blocks around these things, right? They We fit them in between the blocks. So it's fine. It'll be fine. Okay, so that goes like that. And then we're going to have another station over here to service all these. No! Wait. Can it happen, though? It can go underneath. Oh, that's incredible. I'll tell you what. That is a thing of beauty. The fact that we can fit one underneath the freeway is pretty is pretty special. But maybe we don't need to, actually. Maybe we don't need to fit this one underneath the freeway. Look. Because this is going to expand up too, right? This expands up to about here. And then further along up to about here. So we'll keep, try to keep the line in line, if you see what I mean. So it'll be something like that. Then we can just fill in the gaps after. We just need to see where the actual... Um... Wait, is this terrain uneven? No, it's not even. It's fine. Okay, good. Alright. 
So then we have another thing come up here to here. That does not look even at all, though. <laughs> Whoops. What happened there? It's not straight. Wait, it could be straight. It's not... It's not quite straight, I don't think. It's not straight with that. Yo, daddy boy. Been Yo, subbed before but never watched the stream live because I'm stuck in a shithole called Australia. Are you what comes up when you click on ads on how to make easy money from home? Greater than three. That's BTW, exactly. I said hi to my mum for you. That's she said hi back. Exactly what I, what I come up as the guy who can easily make money from home. Hey, thanks so much for saying hi to your mum for me, Sips Wine. Thanks so much. And Erto, and Dottis92. Thanks very much as well for the, um, for the donations. I appreciate it. All right, let's connect this up here like that. Okay, so Mayor these are six, I've sold monorails to Brockway, Ogdenville, and North Haverbrook, and, right. by gum, it put them on the map. Nice. Well, sir, there's nothing on earth like a genuine bona fide electrified six-car monorail. Oh my god, you're so right about that. Monorail! 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 Okay. Wait, I want it to be here just in case we build a park in here, okay? So I'm gonna put one here too. Okay. That's the line, baby. It's going all around the city. It's gonna be easier for people to get to the places they wanna go. And it's gonna go both ways! Ha! <laughs> They just about clear here. <laughs> Look, they just about clear. It's fine. You know what? We can do better. We can do much better. Look. We can go like this. There. How do you like them apples? That looks stupid. <laughs> that looks really... It's safer, though. It's safer. But lord. Okay, we might need to do some work on that one. We'll leave it for now. It's fine. Okay. Back into this, then. Just glorious. Oh. I've got a lot of time for that curve. Okay, Teagles. This is where you truly The term shine. originates from joining mono, one, and rail, rail. From 1897, possibly from German engineer Eugen Langen. The more you know for Dotis. P.S. I love you, Dad. Oh, I love you too, man. Thanks so much. Hang on a second. Oh! We don't need power lines there anymore. Look, the monorail station saved us. It's the connector. Oh, that's incredible. That's incredible. Okay. That is amazing. God, that's made me so happy. I don't know if you could tell. But man, I'm a happy guy right now. Okay. Now for my next trick. It's gonna cut right over the road because it can. Because it can. That's why. Alright, let's put this bad boy here like this. Uh, this bad boy is gonna have to come straight for a bit. And then it's gonna have to curve a little. Good. 
good. How does this work now? I think that fits, you know. What the hell? Is there a chance the track could bend? No. It'll never bend. What are we on right now? Oh. We're on Europa Universalis 4 now! The Age of Discovery. Oh, yeah. What about Hearts of Iron? Hearts of Iron 3, Sounds of Conflict. Is there no Hearts of Iron 4? Um, there isn't. There's no Hearts of Iron 4 soundtrack on here. What the hell? There's the Hearts of Iron 3 Sounds of Conflict, though, from 2012. Sabaton Hearts of Iron. Here, boyo. Have some money. Keep building those roads. Love, your favorite Canadian goat. Sabaton. What about Adrenaline Workout? Hearts of Iron. What else can we just do? Um, Europa Unit to South 4. Actually, you know what? I'm up for listening to this. That's fine. Okay, we can do it. Hey, what was that? Goats TM. Thanks so much for the for the bits. My Hindu friend. <laughs> Thanks for the donation. Dotus92. Thanks so much for the donation as well. Okay. Let's continue connecting up our new prize possession. That's right, it's a monorail. I like the old the old curve across. Makes me happy. Okay, perfect. So we run that down like that. I think the trickiest part is going to be hooking it up by Slime's ball bag. Does it need to be tricky though? You know what? I'm not sure it does. Fuck it. Look at that. Goes right over the fucking road. Smashes into like one of these bits of the under oh you know what that can be fixed though i don't even know why that's so low what the hell does that look okay that actually looks kind of nice all right, so that's fine, that connects. And then we can just connect up over here. And then profit. Okay, all right. It's time to make our first monorail line. It's going to take you to places you've never been before. In the city that you live in. Some stops don't have any plumbing or power yet. We'll work on those soon, though. God, this is going to be a, a mammoth one. Line complete. We're going the other way too. We're going the other way too. That's right. All the way around, baby. 
Wait, are we? Yeah, look, there's two tracks. It's fine. It's fine. Chad, I don't want to hear it. Don't you dare ruin this for me. Look, our first monorail has departed. How many people are on it? Zero people. Here we go, look. Look at this. It's traveled 4% of the line. Hang on. Anyone to pick up here? <laughs> Not a single person. All right, next one. Nobody! Hang on a second. All right, we just need some time, okay? The simulation just needs some time. The simulation just needs some time. And then people are gonna realize, hang on a second. I don't need to drive my car. You know what I can do? I can hop on the monorail. I can hop on the monorail and visit all these stations that are un unpowered and unwatered. It's gonna be incredible. And in the meantime, check it out. We have some demand for commercial. Mm. Sexy. Sexy, sexy commercial. Let's build some. Okay. Are you guys ready? Look at that. Fuck, we did it, guys. Zero per week. That's incredible. Oh, I can't believe it. After all of that effort, it was all worth it. A lot of stops don't go anywhere. That's true, actually. Once it gets built up, I think it'll be used a little bit more. But, like, look. You could travel from here to here without taking the metro and jumping off a million times. Plus, you can also admire the monorail from the comfort of your own car on the highway. Oh, that is special. That's something special. That is something to be proud of right there. This traffic, not so much though. We're not too proud of this traffic, actually. I think we kind of want to get rid of these now and send this traffic up to Mugler's Hole. Potentially. I'd rather just be busy at Walur's Hole. So I feel like Walur's Hole can handle it a bit better. Right, because it's got like the roundabout and stuff. See, look, if they just come in like in little bursts like this, we should be good. We've got this whole area up here now, too. Fuck, it's crazy. The view on Highway in Valley looked like a screenshot from Google Earth. Which one? Which one? I'm not sure which one you mean. Look at Teagles. Look at fucking Teagles go. Holy shit. It's like a ninja star. Oh. Okay, so this will this will give power and uh, hopefully has water. Okay, it does have water. Alright, so let's start laying the pipe works in here. That's that all watered up now, so we can expand up into there, no problem. Holy f fuck. Look at the size of this bastard. Jesus Christ. Look at it! Look at the size of this city right now! It's insane! It's a very, very big city! Oh. 
Yeah. Oh. Look. I grew up near Slough, and you've really done that shithole justice. Been look watching it. since the Tekkit days. <laughs> Love the streams, but miss your old episodes. Farm My Hill, wife USA. always shouted hi sips after your old video introductions. Oh, Keep man. it up, you marvelous man. Tell your wife I say hi. Thanks so much, Mr. Lister, sir. 20 bucks as well. Thanks so much, man. I appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Build a dam. We'll build a dam. Don't worry. We've got plenty of time to build a dam. We've got to get this monorail working. Dare I check again? Let's see. Oh. Two! Okay. We got two people traveling on. <laughs> two people who used the monorail last week. I feel like we have to... Oh, you know what? I've got a better idea here. The monorail is now the city's most popular attraction. Well done. Thanks. Thanks so much. Okay, check this out, guys. We're going through the rotary. We're going right through the rotary, baby. That's better, I think. That looks better. Okay, let's just make sure that the actual... The, the, uh, the line updates, though. That would be good, right? Can I have something named after me? Love you, bye. Brad Gore, I got just the thing, baby. You ready for this? You can have something named after you. Look at this. Brad Gore's ghost town line. There you go. Look. Thanks, man. Thanks so much. There you go. It's yours. You got a monorail line. You'll be remembered forever as the guy with the monorail line. That's amazing. Okay. I think what we're going to do here is... Create a new district over here. Very carefully. We're going to create a new district over here, okay? But we're not going to create it straight away. But basically, as it comes out here, I don't want so many IT clusters. I want, like, more offices and stuff. My IQ knows much and tells some. My IQ knows many things others do. Instance, the medical name of a butt crack is interred oily cleft. My IQ remains the liar. There. Okay. We're going to have some, some, just some normal crappy offices out here now. Okay. It doesn't all have to be IT clusters, all right? We have too much IT in the city now. Oh, my God. Walur's Hole could not handle the traffic. Somehow, Walur's Hole is really struggling with this traffic right now. It's, it's too much. There's too much traffic. Not enough people monorailing. That's the problem. We need more people on the monorails. Come on. Get monorailing, city. Mike Q the Liar. Thanks so much for the donation. I appreciate it. Solus the Sun. Thanks so much for the donation as well. Does he have an oil, any oil industry yet? No, I don't. I can add some whenever, though. We have Farmville, USA that has some trash problems. And we have Ore Town, USA as well, which is absolutely pumping. It is pumping. The traffic is not too bad either. There's not a lot of traffic coming out of there. In fact, there's. it seems like the traffic is worse in Farmville, USA. 
it is it's actually worse in Farmville USA somehow I don't know why we just built those so that we get this landmark and then we built a monorail as well we're getting close actually statue of industry 10,000 squares of industrial zone built. I guess offices and stuff count towards that, right? So we might even get it off the back of all of this industry going in. Look at how much commercial we have. Fuck! And there's still demand for more. Unbelievable. That is unreal. That is just unreal tournament. Name that district after me, please. You promised. What also district? enable recreational use there. Which district? Sir Fridge. Oh yeah, this this district, the new one. Okay, when we create it, I'll, I will. I didn't name anything after you, did I, Sir Fridge? Look, you can have the district, okay? As soon as we build it. It's all yours, baby. It's yours. Or would you like the courthouse instead? Or would you like the posh mall? A very posh mall. Mm -hmm. Please fill the triangle in. We will, don't worry. I'm not quite sure how we're going to do it. I guess we could just make roads like straight across. Connect it up like that. here too. Yeah. Yeah. Now this would be a nice park. Okay, you know what? I'm going to reserve this space for a park, okay? It <laughs> The shape is perfect. We can make it really bushy. We'll we'll call it Bushy Park. On Thursday. This area here will be called Bushy Park. Oh, God. Guys. It has to be done. Or should we call it... The Bush. Yeah. Triangles, not trapezoids. Whatever do you mean? I don't think I can make this, like... It's not fine enough to get down here, though, look. Oof. <laughs> Just. Just. Okay. Okay. On Thursday, when we do our parks, that's gonna be the first park we make, okay? And then we'll make uh, Uncle Phil's Memorial Park as well. I got a really good idea for that. Oh man, I'm really looking forward to get let getting let loose on the parks. Ooh, make it round, then sharpen it with other districts. Okay, fine, fine. Pizza Park. I guess it kind of does look like a piece of pizza, like a beautiful slice of pizza. You're right about that. While we're waiting for the whole city to, like, start using the, uh, monorail. We can start... Oh, yeah. What am I doing? I don't need to do this, do I? Sorry, I forgot, guys. I forgot. Look, I can just do this, right? The brush. I can detree. Alright. We're giving Bushy Park a Brazilian. So that we can start from scratch with it. Okay, we'll do. We'll just do a placeholder for now. Okay. We'll do a placeholder for now. Okay, check this out.
There, okay. Good idea. There, okay. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Okay, that'll be the placeholder until we actually make the proper park, okay? Oh, you know what we could have done, actually? Check this out. Check this out. We can do better. We can do better. Look, we can have this. Aha, okay. If it lets me. Oh, I need to turn all this off. Hang on. I need to, like, really freestyle this. That looks great. That looks so good. Okay, and now check this out too, you ready? Oh man. Here we go. It's like the color cheese, right? <laughs> it's perfect. Oh, it's perfect. And then... And then, for my next trick, what's this? Gravel. There's a sand one here too, wasn't there somewhere? Sand? Or was there no sand? Sand. It looks like Parmesan. Wait, what's going on here? Oh yeah, no, we're just filling up the grass with sand. Fine. Gotta make the crust. <laughs> okay, hang on. There's just a little spot missing. Oh, it's perfect. Are you guys... No, it's not ruined. It's perfect. Look, it's crust. It's true. Somebody did die inside Pizza Park. I'm not sure who. We'll have to find out. Later. Hey, Daddy Sips. Been hey, watching up? you for years now and Aww. thought it's about time I give something for all the hours of entertainment. Plus, could you name something after me? Much love less than three. I will. I definitely will. Thanks so much, I3 Sue. Thanks. Deadly Pizza Park. Oh, we're gonna sort it out, don't worry. Okay, how is this industry doing? It's coming up. It's coming up. We're at 131,000 peoples now. We have some more demand for residential. We can maybe make some more in Belle Biv DeVoe, or, or, we can make some more over here. We can maybe, like, join up a lot of this to the old patty cake. Sure. Some residential over here would be pretty good, actually. Okay, let's do that. Right next to the pizza park. Incredible. Incredible. Need some commercial as well. Maybe we want to jam some more commercial. Probably in here. Even though this part of town is already very busy. I feel like we're gonna have to sort out this traffic at some point, boys. Look, it's getting really bad at Walur's Hole. I don't even know where all these fucking people are trying to go. And why they are not taking the monorail that I built for them? 85 people per week taking the <laughs> taking the monorail which currently it'll be more once it's all connected up once all the stations are like operational and stuff look already up here people are thinking you know what hang on that's the kind of monorail i want to take look at that choo choo ping 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 Look, 
Look, see, a couple of people got off. Look, it's already seeing use. Just run it through the town and not just the edge. Well, I will eventually run it through the town. I just have to figure out how to do it. The problem with the monorails is that I think you can only build the stations on uh, like four lane roads, which is not um, not the best. But we can figure out how to do it. We might have like just a, a line that sort of cuts through and connects up two sides or something like that. I'm not sure. I just don't know. I don't know yet. We have to have it like connect down and up into this. We have to figure out a way to sort of like loop it like like we did with the metro maybe there's like some assets for that or something i don't know on road yeah the monorail doesn't have power so the trains run on steam yeah you're absolutely right about that that's exactly what they're doing they're running on steam they're running on fumes they're running on a couple of a couple of fumes i think we're gonna need one of these in here too I think the traffic is because there's a lot of people moving in, or it's just heavy. It's just heavy coming out of Belle Biv DeVoe. <laughs> Belle Biv DeVoe want to use the monorail so bad. I just know it. Oh, I wonder also if in Slough, for Slough, we have to say free public transport. Because we haven't done that yet, right? In Slough. Okay, maybe that'll force more people onto public transport. Why is Teagle so small? It's not, look. It's big. It's a, it's a big boy. He's a big boy who's been here since pretty much the beginning. Look, he's been handling traffic admirably the whole time. It's been flowing beautifully through Teagles. We had a couple of mishaps. Just a few, though. But, please set it citywide. Do I want it citywide? Okay. Alright, we've set it citywide now. Let's see if it cuts down on the traffic. Maybe it'll increase my frame rate a little bit, too. <laughs> without all the cars. <laughs> I mean, it's not too bad right now. We're start We're losing money now, though. See, we're, we're missing out on all of those beautiful, beautiful ticket sales. Never gonna get them back. Oh, shit. No, no, no. <laughs> Wrong industry. There we go. Okay, so we're gonna have, like, a great big office district over there. Even though we don't have much demand for it, but it can slowly build over time. And then it's likely that we're going to want to put some more residential in here. So we'll do that. <laughs> oh my god, look at the traffic going through Walur's hole. Holy shit, Walur. That's a lot of traffic, baby. What a jam. <laughs> Yowzers. What a view, though. It's not quite straight, is it? <laughs> it's not like... It's not perfectly centered. It's not perfectly centered with the highway. There, how's that? Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. That looks fucking great. Look, it looks like the roads are just going right to it, but no, they actually go around it. Are we happy with that? 
even worse. What are you talking about? Look, it's fantastic from here. Look, this is the view that we're going for. It looks a little bit off center. It's, I guess it's because we sh needed to move the highways over. Ah, it's perfect. We'll leave it like that. Good old Walur's Hole. Nice. Okay. The traffic is quite bad coming off Slime's ball bag right now, too. But it looks like it's a whole bunch of cars just trying to get into the into this like downtown area. But hopefully, now that public transportation is free everywhere, yeah, we're up to eighteen thousand people on the metro, which is pretty good. We still haven't even done the buses. We still need to do the buses, and we're losing a little bit of money now, but not much. It's probably fine. Show the traffic map. All right, you ready? 69%. A lot of our problems seem to be... I have so much love for the slough. community you've built over the years. Fuck. You are all the best guys. It's all of this Here's traffic Here's my contribution to, to the Cincinnati Memorial Freeway Fund, which we so desperately deserve. <laughs> Planet peeps. Thanks. I think that's an American hundo. Thanks so much, man. Thank you, Planet Pe plan planet peeps. Wow. 74 pounds and 29 pence. I appreciate it. Thanks so much. It's very generous of you. Thank you. Thanks. Okay. Hopefully this just like gets better with the public transport, right? And with the metros too. We have these metro lines here. I wonder how they're... I added all the extra trains, right? Like, we're not gonna have stations that just have like a million people waiting or whatever. Fuck, there's a lot of dead bodies here that aren't being picked up. We have so many burners, too. It's like we need a crematorium on every street corner, it seems. Just to collect all of these these dead-ass bodies. Simply the pits. Just simply the pits. Uh, which way do we want to build up? Do we want to build up a little bit here, too? I suppose we could. While lures big dumb hole. I like that this, that we can just set out our areas and then, bam, it just starts building. It's pretty nice. It's pretty good. This highway doesn't connect to the city at all. It's all this truck traffic. It's a way to get out of the city. To take this long ass route around and get out of the city that way. That's fine. Okay, how are we doing with this now? Oh, we're so close. We need a thousand more industry and then we can unlock that. We might get another monument off the back of that too. So we've got two unlocked and we're going for our third one. I'm going for the third. What's the other one that we need to do? We need to have um, unemployment very high as well, don't we, at some point. Use red trees for the pepperoni, you silly jabroni. I wanted, I wanted them to be green, though. I don't want it to be too garish. There was method to my badness. Okay, I didn't want it to be too, too much. I didn't want it to be too hot to handle and too cold to hold straight away. snappers I need my little snip snaps on
Okay, great. Hey Sips. Hi. My boyfriend Hayden has been watching your channel for years and loves it. Aww. I was wondering if you could say happy birthday to him. Happy it would mean birthday, a lot. Happy birthday, Hayden. Happy birthday, Hayden. Thanks so much. Thanks, sir. Apitus. Thank you very much for the donation. Happy birthday. Say happy birthday to Hayden from all of us, too. Oh, how old is he? Let me guess. 74 years old today. Oh, my God. He's been retired for, like, nine years. He's loving every minute of it. Cruises in the in in the Caribbean with his with his woman friends and stuff. Oh god damn. Living the life. A man penion. <laughs> yeah. More like twelve. <laughs> Maybe twelve, yeah. Hmm. Thing is like the older you get, the younger you act, right? Like and then when you're like in your nineties you you're just like a baby again. So at seventy four you're like almost kinda twelve. In a funny way. You don't have to work. You don't have like any responsibility anymore. People do stuff for you. Just like they did when you were 12. So it's like the same. You're just not as into Nintendo as you were. And um, you can't sit down for a very long time because your hips seize up. When you were younger that didn't happen. But it, it, it swings in roundabouts. It's fine, right? Oh, it's age in reverse. Yeah, that's exactly it. When, right before you're about to die, you're pooping your pants. You're like... You know, you can't even eat solids anymore. Somebody has to, like, feed you mushed up pizza and stuff like that. So you're like a baby again. Right? Is something wrong with the sewage? No, I don't think so. We need some more treatment, but I don't think it's, like, it's not, like, hooked up to the water or anything like that. I don't think, anyway. We just need a little bit more treatment. In fact, could do with a little bit more water as well. Okay, good. Good? Happy? Nobody's dying. It's fine. Everybody's everybody's good. Everybody's in good shape. Yeah? It's not the sewage making them sick, it's the noise. Oh yeah, that's because the monorails are very noisy. You're probably right about that. You are probably right about that. Oh, look at this. What? This is all commercial in here. Home of the stuff store. Does commercial get bigger when it's fully upgraded? Increase the value of the land. Okay, let's do some... Oh, yeah. Let's increase the land value here and get some things and see if it actually helps. Ping, 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 pong, ping, pong, ping. Okay, that's fine. We need a little bit more commercial. Hang on a second. So that should upgrade pretty soon. A lot of this stuff should upgrade pretty soon. Oh yeah, look. One just did. We had a little ding. We're having dings. Okay, they are upgrading. Good. They got everything they need here. I didn't build that, like, over top of anything, did I? I don't think I did. Okay, should be fine. 
Oh my lord. Look at this hot spot back here. Jeez. Jeez. I like these pl ploppable parks because they fit in my grids. They fit perfectly inside my grids. That's why I use them. I don't have to like worry about, you know, like little one square buildings building again or anything. It's fine. What? Can I get a dead end named after my life? Chrome 77. Yeah, I'm sure you can actually. Hang on. Let's see if there's a, a nice dead end here for you. There you go. Chrome, Chrome 77 Street. There you go. <laughs> That's all yours. A real dead end. It leads nowhere. It leads to nothing. It's going, it's on a fast track to nowhere. How's the rest of this traffic doing? It's just very dense inside the city right now. Do, do, do. Down, now, 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 now. Down, down, down. Bow, bow. Do we want to connect up some of these highways? I don't know if we connect up these highways. Do we connect this road up to this highway here, and then this highway up to like here? Or do we not really bother with that? Just leave this as it is since it's working. Oh my god, I forgot about this. Let's see if we have any takers. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh my god. His Oldsmobile almost flipped over onto its side. Surprisingly, there's still people taking this. Whoa! Oh, I thought the big truck was gonna go for it. It didn't, though. Okay. Wow, fucking slough is getting huge, isn't it? Jeez. I think the traffic is fine everywhere else, pretty much, except for Walur's Hole. It's just backed up for miles. And this is a pretty bad spot here too. I don't know really how we um how we fix it. I, I was considering running a, a road right through Pizza Park, but I don't want to do it. I don't want to run a road through Pizza Park right now. Maybe you should connect up the monorail stations with water and electricity. I know, but then I have to remove the fucking power lines and stuff after, and it drives me... I hate doing it. So I'd rather just, like, connect it up with, um, buildings. See what I mean? Let's get all these people off of this busy street. Do the same down here. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Okay, good. So we have some demand for commercial. 